More breaking news now and more tragic news. A seven-year-old is struck and killed by a tow truck while on his way to school in Brooklyn. It happened at the North Portland and Myrtle Avenue section, cross-section in Fort Greene. CBS 2's Jennifer Bisram joins us live from the scene this afternoon. Jennifer. Chris, you said it. This is just heartbreaking. Everyone we talk with here today say that is the word that they have been using. A seven-year-old boy struck and killed while on his way to school in front of his mother. Take a look at the scene at this hour. Police just cleared out the yellow tape. You can see in the distance there that tow truck that did hit that boy. And if you look a little bit more to the side, you can see community members here. Lots of them were out all morning long, just in shock, could not believe that this happened, many of them witnessing this tragedy early this morning. Now, we've learned a 54-year-old driver of an NYPD Witnesses say she was speeding and took the red light and she was on her cell phone. We're told the mother just kept screaming, she killed my baby. Take a listen to some witnesses. Devastated. Why? I was coming to get my baby's breakfast this morning, and the tow truck hit that little boy. He had the crosswalk. He was coming through the crosswalk. He had the right away on the scooter. She hit that little boy and was going to keep going. I had to tell the housing workers to stop her. Go ahead, keep going. The mother screaming hysterically. They killed my baby. My heart goes out to the family of that young boy and his mother and his school, his teachers who were also on the scene. A very tough scene to be at this morning. That was NYPD's Chief Madry this morning responding to the tragedy here this morning. A live look at the scene at this hour. You can see candles, lit candles, are already here for that seven-year-old little boy. Now, police say the driver of the NYPD tow truck remained on the scene. Witnesses say someone had to flag the driver down. Police say the investigation is still ongoing. It's still unclear what charges, if any, the driver will be facing. But again, Chris, just very heartbreaking out here that this morning and you've got to feel for the mother the family and of course this community who say that little boy was just a gem for all of them he was in gymnastics he was a good student in school and on they're just grieving this morning we are live in fort green brooklyn jennifer bisram cbs 2 news yeah jen there are no words for something like this okay thank you very much